Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. How are you all? I hope you all uh, will find. Okay, let's start uh, our lesson. Uh, please open page number 72 of your learner book. We have a topic half a shape. We can separate a shape into two equal shares. It will have two equal parts that are the same size. Here we have a whole circle that if we cut it from the center or fold it from the center or any other shape, then we cut it from the center, it will make uh, two halves. One half this, one half this. Okay. If we cut a circle, whole circle from the center, it will make two parts, two shares. One share is this, one share is this. And if we join them, then it will make a whole circle again. Okay. A circle is also called, uh, this half circle is also called a semicircle. A semicircle is always smaller than a whole circle. A whole circle is always bigger than the half part. This picture shows two halves. Here is a triangle. If we cut it from the center like this, it makes two halves. One shear here, one shear here. Okay, the two equal shears make one whole. If we join them to equal that shears, then it will make a whole triangle again. Here's one half. When we have one part of the object of any shape, it will call it one half. And we have two equal parts uh, or two equal shears, then it will call two halves. We will write, then F will turn into V, E, S. The plural of half is halves. If more than one half, if we have more than one half, then we will call it half. Then F turn into V, E, S, halves. Here we have half when we have one, halves when we have more than one, and whole when we have the whole object, the full object, when we call it whole. Okay, here we have some shapes. We can draw a line to show halves. Here we have some squares. There are many ways to make halves of these squares. If I draw a line from this side to this side, does it make half? Yes, it is. Okay, if I draw a line vertically like this, does it make half? Yes, if I draw a line from this vertex to this vertex, it make a half of square. Okay, if we draw a line like this from this vertex to this vertex, it make two equal shares of a square. For triangle, if I draw a line from the center to this side, it make two equal shares of triangle. If I draw a line from this vertex to the center of this line, it make equal share of this triangle. Or uh, uh, if I draw a line from this vertex to the center of this line, then it make equal shares of this triangle. Okay, let's move to rectangle. If I draw a line at the center of the rectangle it make two equal shears of this rectangle similarly if I draw a line at this okay if we move from this vertex to this vertex does it make equal shears yes it is or this vertex to this vertex okay if we go to our trapezoid, if I draw a line, a uh, straight line like this, it make equal shears of the trapezoid. Is there any other way to make equal shears of the other two trapezoid? If I draw a line like this, does it make equal shear? No, the upper part is bigger than the lower. A um, line like from this vertex to this vertex, does it make equal shears? No, this part is bigger than this. So these two trapezoids are not equal, have not equal shears. Here we have some shapes. Uh, if I fold this shape from here, it make half of this diamond shape. 
or if I cut it from the center also if I fold this circle from the center it make a half of circle or semicircle if I fold this triangle from the center it make half of the triangle if I fold this from here from the center it make half if I fold the this square from the center like this it make half of the center if I fold this rectangle from the center like this it make half of the rectangle two equal share of this rectangle one this and one of one is here okay if I fold this uh, arrow from the center like this it make half of the arrow and two equal shares if I cut it from the center it make two equal shares of this arrow now circle the shapes that have halves does this circle have uh, equal shares no this part is bigger than this okay does this square make equal shares yes it does so we make a circle here like this does this triangle make equal shares no does this circle make equal shares yes you're right we will make a circle here like this does this make equal shares no this part is bigger than this what about this does this make equal shares yes we will circle it from here does this trapezoid make equal shares yes and we'll make a circle here does this semicircle make equal shares yes it make equal shares does this triangle make equal shares yes then we circle it does this semicircle make equal shares no the lower part is bigger than the upper part does the square make equal shares no it does not this part is smaller than this part now open your skill builder page number 42 the topic is is at half and solve it remember when you have a shape if you want to make equal uh, shares or if you want to make halves of that object you have to equal pieces okay now tick the shape that show halves and cross out the shapes that do not sh show halves now you will tick that shapes which make equal halves equal shares and you will cross the shapes that do not show halves and color it also